That's right. When Jesus walked on this earth, he was tempted in all points with you and I. And what did he do? He always chose to please the Father. Two socks, man, they in. Two socks are in. He was tempted. He's I think I saw them on Prada's runway. I know, Prada's runway, two socks. Tommy Hilfiger, two socks on Prada's runway. Exactly, that's how crazy it is. Everyone has to have them. I can love who I was meant to love because of Christ Jesus. Man, if that's what you are, do you not know what happened? Oh no! I do know what happened to Sodom and Gomorrah, but all you like to know what happened to Sodom and Gomorrah? Yeah. Is what happened to Sodom and Gomorrah? And you are going to do it to Sodom and Gomorrah because they are a wicked place. God had already said before the angels of Sodom and Gomorrah. No one was allowed in the gate. She was not a member of the communities of Sodom and Gomorrah. They had shut people out. They had shown them hatred. So God had deemed them wicked. The angels come in, but they were so outraged that they come and they try to rape them and they try to publicly humiliate them. So the angels stay Lot and his family and they take it out of Sodom and Gomorrah and destroy it. Not because those men were homosexuals, they weren't. They were straight. A practice, a common practice. For the young men, when they conquer the battle, would be raped them, to humiliate them. They were straight. They weren't gay. Don't give them that much credit. Somewhere bigger and better than Auburn. You got that much of a red line. I have to get out of here. You obey God. I love God. And that's why I'm here. Sure. That's why we're here. Right. Because hey. we're tired of you making a bad name for our God. Young man, they rejected Jesus Christ just like you're rejecting him today. And they were destroyed. If we rejected Jesus Christ, we would not be here. You know, I'm pretty sure the man in this book is named Jesus Christ. The object of believing in God is not because you're afraid of hell. The object of believing in God is because you believe in God and you believe that it's true. When you only believe in something because you're afraid of consequences, you're sitting in the They refuse to obey His command. You know what upgrade means? It means that you have a